work on will be. I've worked on good that I can have to What happened there? Um, we kind of had a, like, um, construction. Yeah. You know, it was done on construction. When did they move the home? Um, they're not supposed to open until the end of August. Oh. They, they are taking up five floors. Yeah. And they're knocking out walls and rewiring and plumbing and everything. I think they can afford to take that, huh? something else. Okay, we are ready to start. Hi everybody, thanks for putting up with me. And um, do we have somebody that's willing to be a cateteri? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm just going, I'm just backtracking a little bit. The boxes are be okay. Need your buttons. Sophie and Lucy's dad, thank you for that. Uh, yeah, I gotta remember to vote yet tonight. Hmm. Yeah, uh, well, I'm a little behind, but do we have a cateteri? Uh, today's been a real busy day, a good day, good day. Yeah, I got to do Farrah's meds yet. Yeah, I will do that. One, one crafty one there. Lini, Lini's going to be catetary. Okay, all right, sounds good. Lini's on, right? <laughs> hey, did they find you, Philbert? Okay, cool. All right, well, we're going to get started. So, Cataman has a new kitty, huh? Way to go. That's awesome. Lini's feeling a little blue tonight. As in a moderator blue or sick blue? Uh, the movie was okay. Popcorn was better. Oh, is that where is that where Gilbert was? Thanks, Goss. Hey, and if anybody, I know you all love the design on the Ustream and on the blog. Um, we have two people that does, well, actually three, that does those things. But Gossamer 
is a big, big one for that. She's done a lot of that. And also B, our person who has done the logo, and then um, Lens does a lot of the arranging on it. Thanks, Canton. Yeah, Goss does a lot for us, as does B and Lens. Okay, I might have missed a few things, but we're ready to start. And uh, what are you doing up here, Sabrina? I didn't get a chance to go through the emails and matching up. Um, at, uh, I'm still thinking of that stuff today. Matching up x-rays, I was going to say. Matching up boxes with potential emails. So I hope I don't make a boo-boo. We'll try to, try to um, if I notice one, I'll try to run out there. So, Lini, thank you for being catetary. And this one came from Bear Postal and Business Center from California. If that is, oh, that was a little, little, little close. A nice list. Hey, what are you doing there, Buttons? What are you doing? Oh, and we have a card. That's what we like. It says Jackie and Volunteers. Aww. This is. <laughs> Check out the eyes. <laughs> Says, get your sugar buzz on. Happy Easter. Here's something for the catathon. You guys are angels on earth for doing what you do. FFRC rocks. And this is from Sandy S. Sandy S. And her cam name is Poo Man. It's P O O H M A N. Poo Man. Thank you, Sandy slash Poo Man. Get your sugar buzz on. I like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can't. It's okay. No, since I don't have the helper tonight on the boxes, I'm going to be a try to be a little bit neater with what I'm doing. So this is for the catathon. So that means remember that these things will go up for the for auction then. Wow, Sandy, you're a good packer. Thank you, babe. I can help you. We're gonna do things a little different tonight. Tell you what, you sit on the chair. I'm gonna have you keep track of these for me. Okay. I'll send them in the pile. Okay, that would be wonderful. We have a lot of boxes. Yeah, we do. We have more boxes than what I thought. I carried all the little boxes out there. You did. Uh -huh. Or you could just go down to the bottom. You're pulling it from the bottom. No, fully. Aha, uh -huh. I think this calls for a knife. Turn it around. Okay. And we'll just do it this way so I can cut there. Boy, Sandy, you are a good, good packer. Wow. <laughs> On the bottom it says the queen and her court. I saw the I saw the picture of um, Bella oh. and it says Queen Bella. Oh my golly. Sandy, this is beautiful. Look at that. There's a Zelda. There's a gray cat, an orange tiger. A long hair Siamese type, another gray tiger, a calico, and um, like a Persian, and then a cat up there. Isn't that awesome? And on the bottom it says, The Queen and Her Court by Carol Lawson. Um, fine porcelain, hand painted. Oh my gosh, Sandy, this is beautiful. Thank you. 
Ooh, this will be a fine addition to the catathon. Wow. Okay, we gotta put this back Ooh. in there. Here, Jossie, why don't you hand me that card for just a minute? Because I want to make sure we get Sandy. Hang on now. We get Sandy's name on this. Sandy, thank you. That, I'm almost speechless. That is absolutely beautiful. And you see right there. Here, let me take this. S A N D Y. And what's what does that spell? Uh huh. There we go. Okay, now you keep track of them for me. Sandy, thank you. That's it's just it's just stunningly beautiful. I'm gonna put it up here so I know that this one goes inside. It looks like he only has one thing. <laughs> Sneaking out there. And I will write catathon on there also. Wow. I remember the last catathon that we did. Okay, now these things here, see? Do you want to take them to that door, Jesse? That door in there because we have to go out that door now because of the wet cement. Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Sandy. That's beautiful. This one, um, this one is from German, Siggy. And, oh, this is wonderful. Yeah, this is from our friend German, Siggy, who is from Florida. And um, it's food. It's a pack, or it's a case of uh, filet, prime filets, and I thank you for this. My sister Judy uh, was here today, as she is on Tuesdays, and I think she was able to get almost all the food inside the cabinet, so that's, um, so this will come in handy. Thank you, Sydney. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm going to try to be neat as we go, since... I don't have um, a, a box person here. We're going to save that one. This one is one I think, uh, I'm not sure if it came yesterday or not. A couple of these you know did. Uh, this one came from the Kentucky Amazon. Oh, yes. I think we'll just tip it over. Hey, Jesse, you want to take that to the front door? All right, girl. And I don't have a I don't have a card on this one. Could maybe somebody let us know who this one is from? It's a to do to do. It's a 32 pack frisky seafood variety pack. Maybe somebody will help help identify this this giver. But thank you. And and if not, I can look on my notes and see if I might have one on this. So it's a 32 pack seafood variety. I can tell we have the kitties now. Um, we're, we're increasing our amount of cans. Uh, this one is also uh, Amazon. Did we get somebody to claim that one? Oh, yeehaw. I'll set that one up and put that, oops, sorry, hon. Put that plastic in there. Uh, oh, nice. Nice, nice. This is, oops, wait a minute. Hold the horses. Let's see. Oh, this is a treat for sweet little Raza and friends. I sure wish I lived in your neighborhood. I'd give you a forever home. Much love, uh, Anonymous. So this is from Anonymous. And uh, this anonymous friend must really, really like our sweet little Raza girl. And it's a case of um, turkey and a case of chicken. So thank you, our anonymous friend. I appreciate I that very much. One. Oh, I think I'm going to carry them back there together, babe.
Josie. Yeah, there you go, girl. You can take those boxes back. Thanks, thanks, Anonymous. Um, she's taking them to the door for me, so that's a big, big help. I appreciate that with the with the food um deliveries. Well, I, this one they cut off part of the label, so I can't tell where it came from. But maybe there will be something inside. Oh, you know what? We have to save boxes. So, um, but the person that wanted, do you want, can you ask Mary, could, would you mind running out to the, um, kitty, Kathy, uh, and asking her if she wants to stop up here for boxes and I'll put them by the door? She's in Kitty Castle. Ooh, yes. Why do you say Because she has a friend that's moving. This says, um, this donation in is, is in appreciation of the blue bees that Miss Blue Wolf made for my kitty. So this is from Goss. Remember, um, Blue, Blue Wolf made those um, pictures, or excuse me, made the blue bees that I showed the pictures of. I think it was night before last. And in in appreciation of Blue Wolf doing that, uh, Gus uh, sent us some food for the kitties. So thank you, Blue Wolf, and thank you for doing those woobies for Gus. And Gus, thank you for doing this. And this is a 32 pack of the poultry uh, friskies. It's okay, Angel. So I guess you could say that was a double doer. A double doer, thank you. So thanks. Oh, well, let me see here. Do you want to put that one by the door too, babe? Be no, careful. Okay, to. you are very observant. Thank you for waiting then. This one came from Petco. From Petco. Look at look at our patty patty cake there. Uh, let's see what this says. We got a note. No, we don't have a note. Oh, yes, we do. This is from, from Canton Cat. And uh, Canton Cat is the author of those wonderful, wonderful uh, Cat's Cove slash Kitty City um, stories <gasps> that she's um, got on Facebook almost every day. So Canton cool. I have gotten emails from that. And oh, and and Canton, I wanted to tell you, I've had a couple people that don't get Facebook. And so they've heard about these stories. So I have patched a few of those stories onto them through the email forum. Here, hon, I'm going to lift this up. It's heavy. This one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six. This is 24 cans of the big friskies. Yay. Thank you, Canton. I appreciate that. Connie's here with her muscles. Yeehaw. Thanks, Canton. I, I love that. That's a, that's a really good. We don't get those big cans very often. Let's see now. This one also arrived from Amazon in Indiana. And I don't see another name on top. Fifi just loves that reel. Do you want to do it right back there? Yeah. Um, yep. This is from... Oh, this is also... Oh, this is also from Gossamer. This donation is an appreciation of Ruby's. Miss Blue Wolf made for my kitties. And Goss and Blue, thank you. We have one, two, three. We have eight uh, mousies from um, the Zanies. Here, I'm going to carry the heavy one. You take those to Connie. So there's eight Zany, Z-A-N-I-E, mousies, and a case of the fish kitten food from Fancy Feast. We're going through a lot of this, those kitty. Do you want me to swap you? <laughs> you did it. You did it. I think it did it by itself, but I'll take it <laughs> So thanks, Gus, and thanks, Miss Blue. I showed those pictures the other night um, of her kitties. I, 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 couldn't, I think there was two 
uh, blue bees maybe or maybe more but her kitties were laying on it and, it, and that was really nice to see that this one I don't know where this one is from other than it came from Kentucky and it's an Amazon would you hold that for me <laughs> Sure. There you go. Oh, wow. Let's see. Right now, you know how we used to put paper down all the time? We're not doing it right now because Mr. Uh, P, I mean, Mr. Patty has been keen on him. So we're giving him a break from it. Oh, gosh. This is cool. This is also from Gossamer uh, in appreciation of the bluebies that Miss Blue Wolf made. I've got a stack there. This is something we've never had this before. Look at this. Yeah, you got that? You got that, Jocelyn? Cool. Thanks, Big. Look at that. A bunk bed and playroom. All-inclusive activity center for playing, hiding, and sleeping. Two spring action toys. Durable quilted pad for extra comfort. Heavy-duty wood construction. Ensure safety and stability. Encourages the mental and physical low stimulation. We like that. Goss and Blue, we will be putting this together. I have one other thing, too, i got to get put together. we got that tunnel thing that I want to do, too. So we'll have some fun with both of these. Won't get to it tonight, but you know what? Let me get the tunnel one out because I've been very neglectful and haven't put that together yet. So there, we will get these out and put them together and hopefully tomorrow night we'll have these new new toys. Ha ha ha, you know what, this is Steve's kind of thing. He, he's been helping me a lot with stuff. We'll just leave that there and we'll get that put together. Thanks guys and thanks Blue. Uh, I'm going to sing, I'll stand them together, but... Oh my golly. Gee, let me help. <laughs> Guide me over there, Connie. Yeah, I'll be really <laughs> this is from Canton Cat from Petco. And this is so heavy, it has to be either food. Yep, it is. Oh, it's another another one of those big duper packs from Canton Cat. And, oh, there's two of them in here. Um, this is the Ocean White Fish. One, two, what did we say? Six, eighteen? Cool, Canton. You know what we're going to do, too, is help restock Cat's Cove with these big cans. And there's a third, so there's three, I guess you could call these cases. Um, these, oh, these are the Friskies. They like this one. This, it's the Mixed Grill. Thanks, Canton. Um... You got room, and we're going to, tomorrow, I'll, um, I'll get some of that out there, and we'll get uh, Cat's Cove stocked up with those big cans. That will help a lot, and we'll use them in here, too, Cat, and, but um, that will help a lot for out there so in the cold. Sure get them. Okay, cool. Isn't it pretty? Mm -hmm. uh, this is from Canton. Boy, we hit the jackpot from Canton here. Looks like this box got a little squished it in there. Oh, yay. Oh, my goodness. Canton, thank you. Thank you for this food. We can definitely use every can of this. So we've got, it looks like we have four cases of various friskies four yeah these are really great oh this is the mixed prime filet but um we could just we could put this down as four more cases of the friskies and this is a prime filet they love the well they love it all oh you're pretty good and another one so i think canton has us in uh cat food supply before we're before we're done, um, I got to give you some updates. 
and tell you about the construction too. I'm so excited. So thank you, Canton. I'm I'm beholden to you for all this food. Wonderful. Whoops. Steve was talking the other day. Uh, yesterday, he said, uh, "Don't," because he always would go with me to get the food. And he said, "Don't we need to be going to get some food pretty soon?" He hasn't he hadn't gone for a while. And I said, "No, our webcam viewers have kept us in supply." So he thought that was pretty cool. I think this is an anonymous one, and it comes from Walmart. I would feel bad if I cut me, but I'd feel triple bad if I cut you. <laughs> Here, Jaffe, why don't you take this out? Oh, yes. So, Canton helps us with the food intake, and our anonymous friend helps us with the outtake. <laughs> this is 37 pounds. No wonder it's so heavy. 37 pounds of um, double duty. Extra value kitty litter. Wait, you know, I would think some of you want me to help you with that. Connie's George. This box is equally heavy, and I'm hoping I'm going to fetch up that there's, I don't know, maybe it's a little different way. Or I got stronger after lifting that one. This one is also from Walmart. And it's also from our anonymous friend. Yes. So, Canton and our anonymous friend must be working together. Going in and going out. You want to lift the box? There we go. Thank you so much. Thank you our, to our anonymous friend. Thank you, thank you. Two big boxes of the double duty. Can you get it? She's not even breaking a sweat. And then this came, this was I think part of our last one. Um, this is from Twiggy's mom. And hang on one second. Let me make sure I don't have a note on that if I'm supposed to hold it. Let me look. Okay, to open this up. So that's good because I'm really curious about this one. So, and um, Twiggy's mom comes from Colorado. Here you go. Do you want to come over here? And I'm going to start handing you paper. Wow. What? Yeah. Okay. Look. Look. Something's in that. I'm just looking to see if we have a card. Did you check on the top? I did. Well, this is from, wow, this has a whole bunch of good stuff in it. We have the Kitty Play Club. Cute. Yep, Twiggy's mom from Colorado. Uh, we have the kitties play too. And maybe we could get that one out. I think that last one. You know those last quite a while, but eventually with all this they you know, here the kitties are really bad. They're really rough with toys and, and they start tearing apart. But they love them. Oh my gosh. You know, I think I have a note. Is Twiggy's mom on there by chance? This is beautiful. Now, hang on. Hang on. Look at this. It's a seashell and the blue. And uh, I think these are 
Yeah, dish, two dish towels. These are really, really pretty. Is Twiggy's mom on? Twiggy's mom. Oh, oh, did I, did I miss it? Twiggy's mom. Oh, that's what I, Twiggy's mom, that's what I was wondering. So, um, we can use anything here for Catathon or, um, or for the Rescue Center then, right, Twiggy's mom? Thank you. Um, I know it, it's beautiful, but also, this matches something in the, in the, well, how about we save some and we'll kind of divide this out a little bit. We've got some toys here. This one's kind of Oh, you got to wait now. You've got to wait. That one's yours. Mine, mine, mine. We've got a bunch of toys. You know where the toys go to we yeah. meet them? And, you know, Connie, if you want to take like a couple of these and we'll take the tags off and let the kitties have them. Thank you, Tweenie's mom. Mm -hmm. We've got, oh, these are doggy toys. There's a pack of doggy toys. And, you know, we do um, things for the dogs for the catathon also. Thank you, Twiggy's mom. And let me change my chat box here. There we go. I got behind. And look at this. Wow. There's a whole bunch of these. Oh, oh. You know, the ones at the public when our visitors come have been um, getting really ratty. I think what we'll do is change these out with a couple of these. Connie, I think I'm going to keep like three or four here. And we can put a couple back there. Sure. And then these will be great. I think they'll be a little tougher than what we've been using here. Oh, my goodness sakes. There's a bunch of stuff here. Oh, you're, yep, this is a Justin Bieber, One Less Lonely Girl. <laughs> and there's a whole bunch of toys. What is this one? It's a kid, it's a long cat. It's designed by Ned Young from Ohio. Blossom Bucket. Isn't that cute? That was, that, you know, our, our uh, wicker room is blues and browns. This would look cute on the one of the wicker stands out there. Cute, cute. And toys. Okay, okay. A whole bunch of really neat toys. These are the multi-pet cat toys. Wow. There you go. I'm going to keep this one out here so I keep track of that. Um, and the tunnel. I think we have a tunnel that we're using right now. So... Uh, Tweenie's mom, when that one gets um, used up, we'll we'll get this one out next then. Those those are the most fun. If you guys find these, they crinkle and the cats love them. They love them, love them. We gotta do this one next. Here's the cards. Here's the cards. Okay, we gotta do cards. This one. <laughs> A keepsake bookmark. Thank heaven for you. Oh, this is for an Easter. Thank you for all you do for the kitties. Twiggy, Twiggy's mom, and um, Twiggy's mom's first name is Ruth, and it has a bookmark. Twiggy's mom, thank you. I'm going to um, read all of that in the house, and I love the bookmark. I love to read. This is for Steve and me, so I'll take that inside for him to look at, too. And it says, Young Kitties and Kitties. Aww. Happy, oh, happy first Easter. Happy first Easter. And on the back, it says, Love you lots. Isn't that cute? For all the kitties who are having their first Easter, you're cute as a bunny. You're awfully sweet, too. So this first Easter wish comes with love just for you. Enjoy your first Easter. Love, Twiggy and Mom, Ruth D. Um, honey, do you think this maybe we 
could get some. Oh, there's some in my top drawer on the left of my desk. Give me the left desk. Oh my gosh. I'm not really out of tape. <laughs> oh. Well, let's do this one first. This is for the volunteers, and then we'll put... Oh, you know what, Connie? Yes. We could we could set this on the refrigerator, too. Right here. And then this one for the volunteers, we will as well. Easter time's here. Oh, my goodness. Look at that beautiful, beautiful card. To all who volunteer, have a decorated egg, a jelly bean or two, but mostly have a happy heart this Easter all day through. Have fun. Love what you do, Twiggy and Mom Ruth. Ruth, thank you, and Twiggy, for thinking of the volunteers like that. There, we've got those on the fridge. And this one is in memory of Twinkle. I'm telling you, that Twinkle has kept her herself present here, hasn't she? In the loss of one you loved. Wishing you comfort in the beautiful memories. Sorry for the loss of sweet twinkle. You used the money where most needed. Love, Ruth D., Twiggy, and Twiggy. And, um, Leanie, if you could put that there's a donation in memory of Tweenie, I would appreciate that very much. Thank you, Ruth and Twinkle. Er, thank you, Ruth and Tweenie. Tweenie. And I think we have a picture of... It's Twiggy, isn't it? We have a picture of Twiggy. That kind of sort of looks like our um, buttons, Kitty. It says, please, please use any items you wish for the Catathon, Kitty Castle, or any of the Kitty areas where they may be needed. Then that means then we're going to put this in Kitty Castle because that will look cool in that blue room. I so appreciate the work you do. You have my utmost admira admiration admiration, for your absolute dedication to your passion of caring for the kitties. I wish for you continued success and the many blessings of a job well done. You truly are a friend of felines. Fondest regards, Ruth Ann D., Twiggy's mom. And then she's got on here, why cats wash after eating? I don't think I've heard this one yet. Some years ago, a famous cat, the pangs of, pangs of hunger feeling, you could take out some of the ratty ones, had chance to catch a fine young mouse who said as he ceased squalling, all genteel folk their faces wash before they think of eating, and wishing to be thought well bred, puss heeded his entreating. But when she raised her paw to wash, chance for escape affording, the sly young fox said his goodbye without respect to wording. A feline council met that day and passed in solemn meeting, a law forbidding any cat to wash till after eating. Author unknown. I have never heard that before. I'll save that for my collection of things I'm doing. That's cool. Thank you, Ruth Ann. So we have also have a cool pillow that we can use. And, and Ruth Ann said anything in here we can use for um, Catathon, Kitty Castle, or uh, here in the Rescue Center. So thank you, Ruth Ann. I'll put that right there for a minute without blocking. And it, that is very soft and squishy. Mm -hmm. Oh. Look at this. This matches. Oh my gosh, that is really beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. And I think, whoops, I just tossed some more down there. Oh my, wow. Oh, hello, Kitty Stocky. Oh, these, we're going to have fun putting all these baskets together and some toys. And there is a ton of these. Cool little kitties, the multi-pack kitties. These are, these are really neat. I We had gotten one in one of the packs not too long ago, and I saw one of the baby kitties playing with these today. There's just a whole... Oh, and, the, and binder clips. I can use those for the volunteer stuff. 
And another one, binder, two packs of binder clips. There's something else. There's just a whole bunch of these, these Lupa pets. Do you want to take off a couple? Mm -hmm. Or else we could use three different colors. Thank you, Ruth and Young. And I'll put these in now, uh, up front, so I can use them when I do the volunteer thing. Here, we're going to save them. Yeah, you just wait. Oh, I know what we're going to do with some of these. This is Scramble Squares. Um, perhaps the world's most challenging puzzle. And let me show you the rest of this too. Success stickers, which you know we have a lot of fun with those. And these would also be cool in one of the one of the kids baskets for the catathon. And look at this. It says cat laughs and bad kitties. And I have this really pretty basket that's out there in um, Kitty Castle for our any of our guests if they want to um, sit and read a little bit. And these are the perfect sizes of the books that I have back in there. And this would be kind of fun to do, too. I've, I've seen one of these a long time ago, and it's kind of neat. It says for ages 4 to 104, how to solve the scramble squares puzzle. Unscramble the nine square pieces by perfecting matches, and it forms one large square of the kitty. So that would be fun to put in a little, um, yeah, wouldn't that be fun to put out there, too? in a little sleeve and we'll put that out there also so wow this I this will be fun for out there and we'll probably use some of these but that would be fun for the um, kids baskets also Dirty. Ah, these are nice. Very, very, very nice. These we'll use in here. These are really nice. They're stainless steel little bowls. Oh, thank you so much, Ruth Ann. These will be great. There's um wow, there's just one, two, three, four, five of the of um kind of the dish one and the deeper dish. Wow, there must be three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, I think. So thank you, yeah. Do you want to stick those over there where the stainless steel holes go? Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oops, oh dear. Let me let me um see if I can tilt Jocelyn the nun's calling. The light over there. There we go. Maybe that'll help. Can you see that? Look at that. <coughs> it says on the back, Ruth D. Uh, Ruth, did you? Ruth, you made this, didn't you? It's, it says uh, feline fantasy. Isn't that beautiful? Can you can you see it pretty good that way? I have a ref, uh, very big reflection from this thing. There, maybe that'll help. It's absolutely gorgeous. And there's another one in there. Yeah, it's it's uh, cross-stitching. Yeah, it's beautiful. Wow. I can't wait to start putting things together. For, oh, there's, oh, they're different. They're both, they both have that same wonderful kitty. And this one has blue eyes, whereas the other one had green eyes and a rose. Versus like a lily maybe on the other one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so so look. This picture here is called Feline Fantasy. And this one is called Royal Highness. Oh, Twiggy's mom. These are absolutely gorgeous. You got red ribbon at the county fair. These are just absolutely beautiful. Now I know another reason why you why you pack the pillows because there's another one in here. You use them to keep the keep the in addition to beds for kitties. Um, you use them to protect the pictures. 
Vera. That was pretty cool. Oh, is Mary still here to take the box? Well, if not, we still have to go out that way. Wow. So, um, Trees on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just keep taking things upstairs. And one of these days, a little bit later, uh, we'll start combining our baskets together. And they're going to be neat. Hey, I'll give you a little, little, um, see the green that's on here? The cat and kitty castle. The green that's on the wall is a little bit lighter than that. So that gives you an idea of what color that is. I made an Alaska box for the catathon. Cool. Cool. They could, um, other than I have to see if we have room out there now. We've got, you know, we do have one of the walls. I'll see. Actually, I've turned over all the decorating that's been done by Angie, and she's just done a phenomenal job. But I want to show her those because they would match in there. But yet they'd also be wonderful for the catathon. Okay. This one is from our friend um, German, City, German City in uh, Florida. Oh, and it's an Easter card. Isn't it fun to keep getting cards and things afterwards? And you and, and uh, I know German Siggy made this. I'm sure she did it. So cute. Happy Easter. My mom is 92, still makes cards. Oh, for all seasons and celebrations, she's a good egg. Hope you and your family have a good one, too. Um, your German, your German Siggy friend, greetings from Jenny, too. Um, Jenny is German Siggy's sister. So your mom makes these, and she's 92. Is that, see, I just think that's awesome. Yeah, it's fun to keep getting things. Yep. That's really cool. I wish I wish all of our older folks would have something that is really their passion and fun thing to do. Badu has been up there I don't know how many times this last couple of days. She's up there on the catwalk and you the way I know that she's up there is because um you're all the scratching and digging and running and tearing and it's uh, Badu just going absolutely crazy up there. <laughs> Sounds like we got a badger in the walls or something. <laughs> oh, this is from German Siggy. It says a little box of goodies is on its way to you. Thank you again for everything. In your Easter bonnet with all the frills upon it, you'll be the grandest lady in the Easter parade. My mom always sang that to me. Oh, I could write a sonnet about your Easter bonnet and of the girl I'm taking to the Easter parade. Oh, this is, uh, this is cool. Siggy, look at this. It's a $1 bill. Oops, let me put something behind it. But look at what's in the middle of it. It's a bunny rabbit. Isn't that cool? No way. <laughs> oh, a bunny bill. Yeah, I can. That's really cool. Thanks, Siggy. Uh, I know a lot of the people at the banks here in Defiance. We're so small. Well, I still call us a small town. Um, I'll have to have some fun with that. And it says bunny bucks on it. It says this bill is legal tender, though. Maybe it's a president bunny. <laughs> Thank you, Siggy. That's really cool. I like that a whole lot. I'm going to keep that in the house and show show the kids when they all come. Thanks, Siggy. I think that that is all we have. Let me give you a little bit of update on things. I do is one nut. She's just yeah, my Callan's just staying enough out of touch, out of her way, so that she doesn't get them. Okay, so we moved um, we moved uh, Philbert up here today, and he's here in Patience's pen. I'll show you Philbert. Hey, Philbert, he's a big boy. Oh my God, Moses! You know this is a small um, bodied cat, but my golly, he is he's big. He's 
he's got a lot of weight on his small frame, we'll say. He is really sweet. Now, he's got um, some dental problems where he's got to take care of. Yeah, he's solid. <laughs> and uh, his, is it your left eye, isn't it, buddy? Mm -hmm. His left eye is not there, but it's not a sewn shut eye. And I think his chances for adoption will increase big time if we can get that eyelid sewed shut. So I believe we're probably going to set up a surgery and get his dental and his eye done and make him a little more um, breath smelling better and uh, even more handsomer yet with that eye. That eye seems to bother him a little um, in way of drainage and I think if we have that done that that will eliminate a lot of that problem. He's a fun boy if you scratch his back here he gets so goofy that he'll turn around and he licks and licks and licks your fingers and your hands. Yeah. Yeah, can't get dirt in there then. Yeah. Oh, I know. He's so cute, isn't he? Yeah. Him's a big boy. We had him out today. When I left for the movies, we couldn't find him to put him away. Here he was way in the corner under um, Patience's pen. Remember, he had, he's been living at a vet's office. Uh, he's been living, I think they said he was in the... Um, boarding place and then at night they would open that door and let him cruise around in the clinic. Okay, you know what, Farrah, honey? Come on, you're going to have to come out of there. Yes, you are. Don't argue with me, Farrah. You can go back up there. Why don't you eat your food? You look like you're hungry. There you go. And so that's the Filbert. Um, Update, we also have another kitty whose name is Sugar Plum, and this is the one that um, Stacy found today at her house out at Lake Christie Meadows where she lives at. She said she got home from work, I think it was yesterday, last night, and heard a meow meow. She thought it was a different cat that was out there, and here comes, so she called Kitty Kitty, and here comes this real pretty uh, young black cat and oh my word she's ever so nice she's just really nice I'm not sure if she's pregnant or not maybe she's full of poopy but either way we, we've we got to um, get her physical I've got to call into one of our vets and um, we've got to get some of these spays and neuters uh, starting to get scheduled because it won't be long till we're going to have all these kitties do and we have to get sugar plum in and we need a physical on Maximilian. And we need to recheck um, Gina. Who's crying? And so we've got we've got some medical issue things that we have to show pretty soon. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot this. On in the blog today, I had mentioned that I had Can you be one years old already, Joe Boo? That seems impossible, doesn't it? Wow. Yes, and when Parisa's kitties are six weeks old, we can get her, she will be scheduled also. Um, so last night I had went to, well wait, a Amy, give Joe Bo a birthday hug for me, okay? Uh, last night, the reason we didn't do boxes was I, I had a program to give to this clothing group, some really cool people, and um, they, it's a quilting group called Stitches to Squares, and they had been at, some of the ladies there had been at a program I had given months and months and months and months ago, really, that long ago, and then she had come here, well, I think it was in the fall time, and needed, wanted to know exactly what we needed in here in way of material things, and so all these months, her quilting group has been making things for us. And there's a slew of, I was shocked when I saw the table, it was full of stuff. And in addition to things like this, which there was a bunch of this stuff, um, there was also paper towels and vinegar and plastic bags and just a soap, all kinds of stuff for us. But I wanted to show you some of the things that they made for the kitties. And this is actually quilted. Isn't that beautiful? My sister Judy, who quilts, was looking at this, and, and there's a lot of detail in this. 
and each of these squares is sewed individually. Yeah, it's very, very nice. And then this is another one. This is they made all different sizes. Got the heart and it's quilted on the back. I thought that was really pretty too. And then there's a bunch of fun ones like this. And I told the ladies there that um, some of these, you know, will get to go home with cats in their crates when they go. Like this would be kind of cool to put in a boy's crate. They are. And these are those uh, fleece ones. This was cute. It's got the purple kitties, green background, and the purple back on it. There's there there was just bags and bags of this stuff and really nice pretty uh, pillowcases. Here's another quilted one and it's got a backing on it. You can see the quilting on the back. And again, these are each individually sewn little squares or pieces. And then these are quilted in the middle of the flower. And the leaves even have quilt in it. This was a fun one. There's the several of these. I thought that was really pretty. And another one. There's just a whole bunches of them. Another quilted one. I thought this was really pretty. I love the colors. The blues and the greens. And then there were some really neat fun ones. These are the black and white kitties and doggies. And look at this one. This is so cheery and happy. Isn't that pretty? And a pink. See, wouldn't this look cute in a crate for a little girl that's being adopted? And these are a bunch of squares sewed together with a green background. And then this would be a cool little, well, this one is big enough. Gosh, we could do this, a lot of things with this. And it's got the three colors on the back. Yeah, wouldn't it be fun to let them have, everybody to have a uh, something cute to go home in their bags. So uh, let me think now. The That, the silver, um, sugar plum. Anybody have anything else I might have missed? And I have to give Farrah her meds yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Lini, you do. We did. We had another peanut, and that's why peanut was renamed after another nut. Um, we own, we try not to use the same name twice. It just helps big time with records. Her babies are doing really good, and she has moved them out of their nest area onto the floor. Except if you read the blog, she hid one in the um, little cabinet that we have in there with the uh, our boobies. Hank and Fabio, uh, Hank's wound is looking excellent. Fabio's looks a little bit nasty yet, but it is, it's in the process of healing. And we also um, uh, are treating Big Al's uh, ear infection. Miraz, is it? We, we, uh, right now I think we have quite a few monitors, but if you want to shoot me off an email, I'll keep that handy. So, um, I'll just have that for my records. Thank you. Yeah, the back door. Oh, that's what I wanted to tell you about the construction. Oh, gosh, I loved, loved, loved today. Oh, thanks, Canton. Um, so the construction fellas came today and they put the doorknob on the door to the bathroom and they, what was the other thing they did? Oh my gosh, we've had so much stuff done. Put the light up so that they're, they are actually all the way done in the kitty castle. We have to paint the door yet. And I think other than that, we're done. So I'm so excited about it. It's just so pretty, and it's just come together so nicely. 
and Mary was here tonight and she put the curtains up in the wicker room and I got to peek in and see and it's really pretty. Yeah, he, the construction guy, one of them asked me if I wanted the lock on the inside or the outside. So, and then, um, they, you know, yesterday they dug the footers for the storage room and then today they leveled it all off and the porch that's right outside this door, uh, they dug that out and, um, framed it up and now, uh, that's got the cement floor on that. And the cement floor is poured for the storage room. So now what is going on is, uh, <clears throat> I don't know if they'll do it later this week or maybe Monday. I'm hoping one of these days real soon. They use a Amish group, uh, Amish crew, and they come in and they will frame the whole thing in one day. It's amazing what they can do in one day with the Amish crew that comes in. So that will be next. So I'm excited about that. Emmeline sore today. We changed her meds for that awful looking sore that's above her left eye. Is it her left eye? And today I was able to remove some more of that sore and it's looking a whole lot better. I'm so thankful for that. Sure doesn't seem to mind, um, bother her at all. And I do think today I'm, I feel a lot better about it. it looks better. Ferris sore on her side also looks better. Yep, yeah, they will. I've asked them before, and if it's the same Amish crew, they, they didn't mind me taking some pictures before. Smiley, normally we work at 80 to 110 in here, um, but we are down yet because we purposely got our numbers down a little bit to help us with our uh, the kitty intake. Connie, they're saying thanks for helping us. You're welcome. <laughs> Um, you know what, Jean, Jean Lynn, uh, the babies are not going to be out overnight yet for a while. Just like today, even though we're here, um, one of the adult kitties got, which one was that? Was that Bodu? Uh, not Bodu, I said that wrong. Um, Boku, and had him down by his neck. Simply was going to try to play with them, wasn't going to eat them, but those are the things that don't want to happen when there's no um, people out here to run and grab. <laughs> Joe, I don't have the anything with the shelving yet going on. One thing that is kind of nice is one of the cabinets, the cabinets and the counter, or with the counter and um, the, the cabinet, the doors up top. Uh, that we had in the, when we had the clinic, one set of those are going to go in the um, storage room, which will be really nice. But I haven't started working on the shelves yet. We love you, Connie. Yeah, I love you guys, too. <laughs> Emmeline's eyes is just all part of that sad uh, immune system problem that she has. Sorry if y'all are sick of me yet. No, never, never. Thank you, Smiley. <laughs> yeah, oops, is ornery. Uh, the outside cats are doing good. The, the ones that came up with the wounds are doing good. We are still missing one, um, the mama, uh, the calico. We still haven't seen her. I'm hoping and praying that she'll still turn up. How are Fifi's eyes? Well, she's going to go in when we take the raft in and have checkups and that all done. If I can't get one of the vets to come here soon um, and have them check. But boy, she's her sight is there. She can see. What am I running low on? Thank you for asking, Ice Maiden. Um, we are running low. I usually don't say, but since you're asking me, I'm going to answer. <laughs> Paper towels. We're running low on um, baby food, meat, turkey, or chicken. Um, yeah, the liquid KMR is get going down. But in, and now that the kitties are getting a little better, now we're dipping into the powder. So that helps too, <laughs> Tommy. Um, and, uh, oh boy, I thought of something else too. Oh, liquid laundry soap, the H-E, we're a little bit low on. 
<laughs> oh, and the uh, the gravy sensation friskies. We don't have very much of that left. I like using that because the the oldsters really eat that well. <laughs> did did I take? Oh, how did how did she get the lid off of that, Connie? Wow, what a smart cat we have there. <laughs> oh. I think she's getting really spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. Hey, you know what, lady? Um, Angel Kisses is really doing well, better. Oh, yes, yes, and the Clorox wipes. I'm very, very low on those also. I appreciate you asking. I usually don't don't come forward with that. Thank you. Thank you for the gravy sensations coming. Yes, it's from, it's by the Friskies. <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh, bubble gummy. <laughs> PG. Oh, you are too funny. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're getting low on our bubble gum stash. <laughs> that's what keeps it, uh, that's what keeps our friend Judy S. coming. Oh, dear. Yeah, the HE is what we have to use for the front loader. Teacups, yes. MC Lurker, you bet. They, it does not have to be. Oh yeah, that would be nice. They do not have to be cat themed at all. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. <laughs> She was angel kisses without eating on the ham bone last night. That's wonderful. She is get you know now that she's getting healthier and um uh it, she's just it's absolutely beautiful. No, the bubble gum is sugar, not sugar free. Yeah, regular bubble gum. <laughs> Oh, the curry cups. Yeah, we use a lot of those. They're, uh, we use the smaller one, the 12 ounce ones. Thank you for asking. We have a Keurig coffee maker here, Bubbles, and um, I don't drink coffee, but I, I do love the hot cider. And But we have it here mainly for the volunteers. They like the coffees and the teas. And hot chocolate and the cider, so it's just kind of a fun thing that that we do for the volunteers. Um, bubble gum, yeah. <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Who's doing that? Thanks, Lynn, for doing the angel kisses. Uh, I'm just tickled pink about that. You know that that hand bone is down to almost nothing, and I've got um, I've got a couple small ones in there too. We'll get those out later. Uh, the the uh, bubble gum flavors is the yeah the double bubble. The double bubbles. Thanks for asking, bubbles. Ah. Most of the flavors that it seems like the, the volunteers like and EPTE is just the regular flavor, you know, not the not the grapes and all that, just the regular flavor. She will give them to a no kill. Um, gosh, bubbles, you ask if they. We could use coffee, yeah, any, we, we, there's so many people that like it, any kind of the coffee curigs. There, should I tell them, Judy, which one you've been crazy about lately? It's the caramel cappuccino. Whoa, that's good stuff. My mom likes that one too. <laughs> um. Hi, Tommy. Angel Kiss's leg is doing better. It's still a little wobbly at the hip, but much, much better. Oh. She's just healing. <laughs> is she playing?
putting all that together. She's so awesome. Yeah, it's 8.30. I got to get up at 3 something, so I better get moving. Do they like sugar, daddies? Yeah. Great coffee? Never heard of that. <laughs> Canton. Oh. I can't wait to see Dave's Afghan. Yeah, I can't wait to see it. That Baju, she's just nuts lately. We love her. Oh, that's what I was going to say. Oh, my gosh. I got so engrossed in the construction, I forgot. The voting. You guys, you're making it happen for us. Um, we are in first place. And we got a good, healthy lead. And I thank each and every one of you for your votes. And I am just thrilled. This morning, I think my hand was shaking. I was, uh, when I checked the, our, the stats on there, it was like, oh my gosh, look at that. It was so exciting. I was just absolutely thrilled and tickled, tickled pink. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Please keep reminding everybody um, to help us vote for us, please. Uh, they can vote every day. And uh, it just... It would be such an awesome help for us. Okay, everybody, I probably missed a few questions, but I got a few things I, I need to still put away. So I'm going to um, head in. Um, Kelly, I see your question here real quick first, though. Um, we, we will probably pull out a few of these quilts. They're not going to make a big quilt for us, but we'll probably pull out some of these quilted kitty things and put them with the kitty baskets. Yeah, EPTE always calls FFRC the Magic Kingdom. Yeah, that, that voting just blew me away. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> Lini, you're cool. I know, yeah, aren't we fabulous? That was just really, every time I thought about it today, it sure brought a smile to me. Yep, okay, I'm going to do Ferris meds, put things away, and then I'm heading in. Thank you for all for being a part of what we do here. And uh, thank you so much for your support and, and being our friend. Thanks. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> what happened, Connie? Nothing. 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 <laughs> it sounded like something, but I'm not going to look. <laughs> uh, Connie's too funny. There we go. Sure. You put that together? Hey, that's cool, isn't it? That is cool. They're going to love that. I did work up the sweat. <laughs> the litter. <laughs> Give me something with no directions. I had to guess I didn't realize how many cool there are like that. That's really neat. I'm going to put these in for this. Yeah. You are good, Connie. All right, yeah, I got to set up for the playground too, though. Okay, maybe we can get Steve. Hey, Steve, can you help me, honey? These things are useful. Uh, if you put it on the table, I'll take it upstairs later for the catathon. And this goes out. Uh oh, here it goes.
Yeah, and then I have I still have one more thing. I have to grab something here though. Are you helping me? You guys want? Oh, are you helping me? Yeah, it was. That was him. Aww. Isn't that cool? Uh huh. Yeah. Are you going to put it like beside putters? Yeah, I think so. But we're going to wait till, um, like the construction guys are done, so they don't accidentally bump it. Is awesome. I couldn't get that one screwed down all the way, so I thought maybe a wrench. But with my fingers, Kitty's I, will probably to be honest, pull them out anyhow. I, yeah, I'm not going to break it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to let somebody else look at that before we do it. Look at all this cute stuff. Won't this look cute? Do you need in a kid's basket? I got a bunch of cat food. I when I ordered, they had to say, you know, they had to say, they had to say, they had to say, Oh, yeah. See, those are fun things to do. Yeah. You are trying to bite me, Octavia. Okay, let me... Oh, there's that cutter. Alright, guys. Let me get things straightened away from your bed. Take this stand and kind of where those go in the top drawer left. 